What's up, guys? Here we are live. The following contest is a steel cage the, match. The pay -per -view. This match can be won by Rumble. Submission or by escaping the cage. And it's for the world heavyweight championship. Making his way to the ring from parts unknown. And from Hollywood, California, weighing 244 pounds. All, some of them are going to be for so free, some of them are not. Hopefully, you know all of them are because I already started. Yeah, some of them are. I already start, started making them, but haven't edited them yet. I'll be editing them when I'm finished editing that. So, yeah. It's really um, it's a tough match. And how many times have I been facing Goldust? In my career, some of them, some nectar rivalry groups, so we ain't gonna last, just come out of nowhere. But I don't know why. We always face him. We always face him. Like, just have to, we have to face him. Like, in that pay per view, but I chose him for payback. I see it now. So, yeah, he was a super team, I was just gonna stop, stop my head. Stop on my head. Then he just picked me up. I reversed it. But it was an easy win to do. He dominated the whole match. Even though he had some, you know, some offense. And he would like punch me and all that. So like that. Hold lines. And I can do hold lines. And all that. But yeah. I dominated the whole thing. But look at that man. He's even reversed. He always had the same move. What a reversal by Goldust! But, Another yeah. stiff kick. Goldust making a statement as we but speak. I did not think I want to be a face. I did not want to be a champion. The world heavy champion. But I oh, still am. I want to be a champion. But I want to go to a gap. To a run. I don't know what I mean. What an impact from that kick! But, I can't be in the money in the back. I don't know if I can, let's see, hopefully. Hopefully I can. I mean, if I'm still the champion. I don't know if that. What was his difficult move that I reversed? And I feel he got his finisher move. I'm stunned by the next. Bam. Seems to be for what? Having the cage. He's doing that. No, no, actually, I think there's two matches, actually. But yeah, look at that silly. The top of the cage. Go on, let's just look at him. Look at that. He made He's it just to looking the at him. The match is up over. And now it's just the descent down. What a climb. Oh, what a match. Oh, what a match. I still see him actually the WWE. He has won. So, yeah, he retains his title. And yeah. I don't believe it. This is a horror. He's going to be a stunner. And yeah. He's going to do it. Well, let's take a look. Let's go to look the look highlights here. The title is still on up. Um, his waist, to put the knee, what's it, but he, he has his waist, his arms in it. It was an easy match, I, I, I told you guys, I dominated it. I dominated it. But yeah, I thought it was going to be hard, because, you know, tower defenses are hard. And look at that. Oof. It was, it was not like it was a tough match, but it was three and a half stars, great. Match is up. And yeah, we are not going to bring away its face mask. Does it even wear a face mask? Yeah, it's a great match. Reputation. Oh, is she saying that I'm going to, uh, that match was going to, you know, um, boost my reputation with the authority? Guess, for the people who don't know about the authority, Stephanie McMahon and Triple H. 
Randy Orton is the WWE Champion. Yeah, look at these girl. Think, um. Okay. Okay, blah blah. Titus O'Neil. So come on, let's see what's gonna happen. Alright, come on. Well this match is I think yeah, it's not that much. You know, all the matches I do, it's not that hard man. But in the upcoming future and this current mode is gonna be changing in in another couple of episodes I'll continue what's gonna be changing so I'm gonna now, until you win this is on that episode. Man, that one rocked it! And that part is good. Oh, that landed like a ton of bricks! Every single superstar in the WWE have a lot of... Oh, that was in the clothesline! One... Yeah, but... Yeah. A battle of wills now! Look at that. The grappling is really the best in grappling in this match. He's dominating it, so... I don't like him. Titus O'Neil may have been a standout defensive end playing football, but he knows all about drilling opponents with a crushing offense. O'Neal mows him down with shoulder blocks and flying clotheslines, rearranges spines with his follow-away slam and sidewalk slam, and all different types of back. Go back to the second rope and jump. And he still can't do this. And he goes there offense. A huge shot to Titus O'Neil. Ah, the stomping minute. I just don't need to take a piss. Now, hey, it's a big time late drop. Um, the triple. Oh, well, I'm not actually. And he hits him with it. an impressive combination of kicks. He reversed the situation with now he has a suplex. Bam. Now we've got a lot of offense in just because of, you know, reversing the situation. I'm so lucky. All of Titus O'Neil's assaults will make any opponent regret that they stepped into the ring with. O'Neil goes out of his way to inflict pain on his opponents, so they know He's yeah, the yeah, real deal. Another beat. A big oh, beat. Man, and he yeah, falls well, I don't know why with the beat. I don't know why with the beat. Yeah, he's So, come on. I can do this. I was just pulling in. I can get a suck. I just dump on him. We've got a signature match. Signature move oh, again. Timber! But now he's only worth it. A one German suplex. Two German suplexes. Yeah. Now, the third a one. Three German suplexes. Two Patrick right now. Through. Oh, this isn't good. Stunner connects, it's all over, it is all over. It's Man, there's no getting up from that! What? Roll break! Roll break, please. Not it was so fast. lucky. Oh, it was so lucky, that's gonna be the end. But I tried to pay him, I actually it tried to pay him, but he kicked out in uh, one car, but... When you're the size of Titus O'Neil, a finishing move on, on an opponent can mean it's the finish so of their career. Not just the match. And if you don't believe so me, lucky. just take a look at O'Neil's class of the yeah. Titus. Now that's incredible. Now we're going to put on the front of the snap suplex. Come on. Oh, nice counter. Look at that, I'm just keeping punching and punching and punching and punching. Stay down. This could be huge. Cool, I can stay down. Bam. But yeah, I'm gonna kick him by everything. We need to see what will happen. If we should consign, we use that leash. We give everything he has to Sugi. He wants to show that he deserves the World Heavyweight Champion. But he doesn't. Titus is finishing so he is so now, it's now he's getting shot. Now he has his finish shot. It's a rare occurrence to see someone get out from the class of the Titus. He versus finish shot. What a counter! I think they say imitation's the sincerest form of flattery, but I don't think that's the case here. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. One, two, one, two. What a move! Oh, what a smart one. move! It's all lucky. Tough match you know. Because everything he was now German suplex from Sudi. Sudi. He may get the three count right here. Stop. Now there's ten. One. Two. Two count. Two count. Hey, yeah, this match is, you know, it's getting tough. After yeah, I put on the you know, um what do you call it? Shoulders down. It's like a wall is telling you to come up and say that. What the match? 
You know, Titus O'Neil has been a monster since day one. First on the gridiron at the University of Florida, and then as a member of the NFL's Jacksonville Jaguars. In 2012, Titus debuted in WWE and became one half of the primetime players. Things got heated when Titus attacked his partner, Darren Young, to make his own fortune. And what a way to start 2014. I'm just not. I'm not sure if he knows where he is right now. Uh oh. 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 Uh One. He's going for the pin. This could two. be it. Three. And that's the match. One match. Fantastic win. The top match. And here's just some of the. Oh, there were some. You want to talk about incredible? I knew. Yeah, I was a face scorpion. Here is your winner, the scorpion. I would be Titus O'Neil in the Royal Rumble pay-per-view. Who would you go after, Titus? Who you play much better today? Magnus, would you have? Yeah? Give more offense. Four stars, amazing. Three years, four stars, and four and a half, five stars. <sighs> okay, blah blah. You can, you can just read if you want. I'm just looking at it. I'm just reading my mind. Saying like a true challenge never ducks a challenge. A true champion never ducks a challenge. Yeah, I know. But some of them do. You don't know. Like. Really, some of them do in it, yeah, some of them do. So, yeah, okay. Someone is bugging me to, alright, oh, someone wants to face me for the champion. El Hondero face me, so I need to defend my tight wing, El Hondero. So, yeah, I am going to be ending this episode here, so yeah, subscribe, like, favorite, comment down below. And yeah, follow me on Twitch, so the underscore.